Hey guys, do you believe this? Police, uh, I mean, chase away a couple little girls selling lemonade on their front lawn to raise money to go to a water park? And the police chief's statement is, is, is it's against the ordinance, so it has to be stopped? Are you kidding me? These are little girls, for God's sake. I mean, this, I mean, are they selling lemonade, folks, in Iran? Because that's what it seems like. This is, this is more of a communist state, more of a dictatorship. This is not a democracy we live in. Don't be fooled. We're, we're, we're a bunch of, a lot of people are so blind as to what's going on in this country. Innocent people being shot in the back. Uh, this is becoming a police state. Okay, these police probably got orders to step it up. The take start taking away your rights. You know what? Oh, don't even get me started. I, I'm going to pull my webcam. You can take a look at this video. Okay, this poor little, these poor little girls, and look how traumatized they are on their faces because they can't sell lemonade. I mean, this is going to be with them for the rest of their lives. I mean, come on. And the police chief says, well, we don't know what's in the lemonade. I mean, come on, that's an excuse. Okay, it's the parents' responsibility, and they know that, to oversee the lemonade stand and make sure that it's clean and sanitary for people to drink. Well, did you ever think of, of not buying lemonade when you see this little kid's lemonade stand? I've bought lemonade off little kids before. What's wrong with that? I mean, it's supporting your little lemonade stand. It, it, it's so cute when you see them out there trying to make a buck. I mean, this is just ridiculous. I mean, I think many parents, times are so tough, Many people may be out there selling lemonade on their front lawn. They're trying to make ends meet to pay their mortgage. I mean, this is this is this is the this is what I'm talking about. You got Bill S five ten. You can't grow vegetables or give vegetables away to your neighbor. I believe it passed. I'm not sure. Uh, you can't they arrest a woman for growing vegetables on her front lawn. They're shooting people in the back for no reason. Uh, it's becoming a police state, folks. We need to stand up. This is ridiculous. This is just going to get worse. Pretty soon you're going to be arresting your children on the front lawn if they're selling lemonade. This is unbelievable. But take a look at this video real quick. Okay. Sounds threatening, huh? Three girls' dream of going to a water park was quickly put to an end after Midway police shut it down. Kind of crazy that we couldn't sell lemonade, so... But it, it was fun and stuff, but we had to listen to the cops and shut it down. Now how traumatized did that little girl look? How confused did she look? This police chief ought to be ashamed of herself and be fired. The girls had only been open for one day before Midway's police chief and an officer cruised by and saw the stand. They told us to shut it down. Cruised by and told the little girls to shut it down? Oh, wow. Well, I'll tell you, these, these guys really... Uh, uh, they should be out there catching criminals, not shutting down little girls' lemonade stands. We shut it down. Did they tell you why they're going to shut it down? Yeah. Tell them, look, we understand you guys are young, but still, you're breaking the law, and we can't let you do it anymore. The law is the law, and we have to be consecutive, consistent with how we enforce the laws. By city ordinance, the girls must have a business license, food, and vendor's permit in order to set up shop. The city says they want to see everyone safe and healthy, and there's no exceptions to that. We were not aware of how the lemonade was made, who made the lemonade, or what the lemonade was made with. So we did act accordingly by city. I say we piss in a cup and give it to the chief. The ordinance. It's almost like they're just, I don't know, they don't have anything better to do. <laughs> I'm going to let it go. I'm trying to teach them good. <laughs> and I don't think if I keep on and on and on. Hold on. All due respect to this mother who had to see her daughters traumatized. We can't let it go, folks. Enough is enough. Oh, that it's going to teach them a good thing. So, the law wins, and what started out as three girls' dream of a fun summer business is now just a piece of plywood. The permits and licenses would cost the girls $50 a day, plus an extra $180 a year. $50 a day? They probably won't even make that in a given day. Come on, give the girls a break. Since the lemonade stand was shut down, the girls have been doing extra chores and yard work to make the money for the water park. See what I mean, guys? I had to show you that. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Time to stand up. I had to share that with you. Anyway, 
The link to that will be underneath the description of this video. You can watch that news clip yourself in full. God bless. Oh, and remember, make sure your kids ain't selling lemonade on your front lawn. They can end up in prison.